Today I'm talking about maximum and minimum thermometer, which is also called six thermometer because it was first discovered by the scientist uh, James Six. That's why it is also called six thermometer. Okay, now let's talk first about the construction of this thermometer, how it is made. Actually, this is made to measure the maximum and minimum temperature of a place, usually of 24 hours. Within 24 hours, what is the maximum temperature of that place and what is the minimum temperature of that place that can be measured by using this maximum and minimum thermometer. It is constructed in such a way that it consists of a U-shaped glass tube and uh, it is U-shaped glass tube in which half of the lower part, usually half of the lower part is filled with what? Mercury. You said to half is filled with mercury, but the upper part with alcohol, it is filled with alcohol, but the, at the top of right hand side, there is vacuum. A vacuum is left uh, at the top of right hand side. Two metal indices are used in two arms. Two metal indices are used inside the alcohol on both the arms of YouTube to read the maximum and minimum temperature. Both the side of YouTube is calibrated with, calibrated with the value of temperature, either in degree Celsius or in degree Fahrenheit. In left hand side, the values are in the increasing order from top to bottom. We can see like, like this, if this is minus 40 degree Celsius, if it is calibrated in degree Celsius, minus 40, minus 30, minus 20, minus 10, 0, and this is let's say 10, this is 20, this is 30, this is 40, and this is let's say 50. But in right hand side, it is just opposite. It is 50 at the top, it is decreasing order, and this is 40, and here we have 30 and 20, and 10 and 0 and minus 10 minus 20 minus 30 and minus 40 this way it is uh, cali calibrated and this upper side is filled with alcohol that I'm showing here with red uh, ink and this metal indices here it is just above this uh, level of mercury metal indices are used and mercury it is shown with blue ink okay this is the construction now this left hand side is responsible for the measurement of minimum temperature and right hand side is responsible to measure the maximum temperature now question comes how it works now let's talk about its working alcohol filled in left hand side of uh, you tube expands, this one expands when temperature of environment rises. Why this one expands? This also expands, but expansion of this rises up, the alcohol rises up and fills up the uh, vacuum and it cannot push this mercury down. But expansion of this alcohol of left hand side has no any space to go up and that's why it pushes the alcohol in the downward direction. It forces the mercury to rise on the uh, tube of right hand side because there is no space to rise on the right hand side. Raised mercury pushes the index, index to certain value of temperature that is the maximum temperature. It pushes this to certain value that is the maximum temperature. Alcohol filled in the left hand side of YouTube contracts when temperature of environment falls down. The same contracts when temperature falls down. Now the level of mercury falls on the tube of right hand side. This previously raised mercury now falls down. But index uh, remains in the same place. It falls down. And, and uh, falls on the tube of right hand side but rises in the tube of left hand side. Now here it rises because contraction means 
here it falls down and here rises. Raised mercury level pushes the index upward. This index is then pushed upward in the tube of left hand side. This index mark gives this this index mark gives the minimum temperature for another measurement. Now it gives minimum temperature. How much is the minimum? Uh, and then uh, within for 24 hours, if we see this thermometer uh, early in the morning, let's say. Uh, six o'clock then what is and the minimum temperature can be shown by this index marks and maximum can be shown by this index mark where it is matching and for another measurement we have to push push this index mark pull down this index mark to the level of mercury here also it has to be pulled down to the level of mercury by using a small magnet magnet can be used to pull it down because it is made up of magnetic substance this index is and that's why again it is set and for another 24 hour we'll uh, see the change of maximum and minimum temperature this way it is used to find out the maximum and minimum temperature of a place